that you have to go through before you can officially call her your wife. And that is why we are here tonight. But before we go into all the stories and all the protocols that go into marrying a Nigerian lady, for you young men who are wanting to marry a Nigerian lady, an Igbo lady, watch tonight because you'll have to go through this protocol. Okay? It doesn't just you don't just come in and take one of our daughters and just go away. You have to go through this protocol. And when you do, we bless you abundantly and nothing follows you but grace and favor for the rest of your life. Amen. 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 Having said that, you know, in every occasion, you have to have a chairman. All I am tonight is just the master of ceremony. Above the master of ceremony is the chairman of the location. I'm sure most of you know that. So tonight, I'm going to call up on my boss for the night, the, chair, the, the chairman of this location. And I'm sure most of the evil men in here know him because Dallas Forward knows him very well. So please, ladies and gentlemen, give it up for the man and the woman who will share this occasion tonight, and if none other than our own Army General, Chief Uthoma Ihana Cho, please give it up for Chief Uthoma Cho. And DJ, please, my new If they didn't pick any for themselves, we trust you, Mr. DJ, our retired general, to do something special for the group. Family. Welcome our in-laws from South Carolina. Mr. DJ, hit it.
thank you, thank you, thank you, and welcome our in-laws. We are so welcome to Arlington, Texas. The Lord says, go out and multiply. We are already multiplying tonight, aren't we? We are multiplying. And now, we are going to be welcoming the family of the bride. and friends of the bride, the Ibe family. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome the Ibe family. Yeah, 
Protected because she is surrounded by warriors. She's surrounded by warriors. They are ready to go to war for our daughter. Give it up for them. Give it up for them. tonight and we'll have the next wedding in the next few months. Amen? So smile. Smile big. Mr. DJ, the moment we've been waiting for, welcoming in the lady of the night, the bride of this occasion, Jennifer Ibe. I'm a to 
Just so you know, Jennifer, Rachel, Chinese. Just so you know, Jennifer Rachel Chinemi was born Jennifer Rachel Chinemi Ibe, but out of sheer hard work, lots of bookworming in the library, lots of work on the computer, lots of work in the lab, she upgraded herself from Jennifer Rachel Chinemi Ibe to Dr. Jennifer. Rachel Chinemei Ibe, please give it up for her. Jesus, my name, my friend. Let our gospel say amen. amen. All right, please be seated. Thank you so much, Reverend O'Kerry, for that wonderful prayer. Now that we've said the prayer, this hall is officially open to transact the business for which we are here tonight. Yes, it is true. We've called somebody here as a group. And we've called him somebody here as a bride. But uh, the protocol, the authentic, original, evil protocol about traditional wedding is just now yet to begin. So if you don't know the evil tradition, this will be the time to learn. So that way, the next time you go to an evil traditional wedding, you will be taken aback. You already know what's about to come. And in every Igbo occasion, it 
in every Igbo occasion, nothing means anything until we make the presentation of the colonel. The colonel is unique to the Igbo people in West Africa, in Nigeria. Other tribes in Nigeria just eat the kola nuts. You know, they, they go to the market, they buy it, and they eat it. That's what they do. But the Igbos have a tradition when it comes to the kola nuts. Until an Igbo man gives you kola nuts or serves you kola nuts, be careful. You are not yet welcome into that environment. So for now, I am going to call upon. Our host for tonight, Arabi. Where's Arabi? The presentation of the color nut. So while we're waiting for the color nut to arrive, I hear I heard that the color nut came through the customs safely this afternoon because this color nut traveled all the way from Nigeria to be with us tonight. And from what I was told. When the colonel made it to the airport, going through the Department of Agriculture, they stopped the colonel. But then, we had to... Unfortunately, Kola Nod does not speak English language. 
the only language he speaks is Igbo language. From now until we finish the call and not issue, there will be no English language attached to it. But I have to go to my in-laws and give it to them. Thank you for the call. Having the cherished calling us, I now return them to you. Thank you very much. And the Kani, I'll try below. Good luck. I'll try below. Okay, we're present in the most of our job. Tony, because I'm a man. I go go kill him. Man, yeah, what you know, this drag out on your subject. No, no, what is in the time? Ibo Bebu, 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 Bebu. Here, 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 here. I put you on the hand. You put it in on that. My call went out. You said, I'm going to show you all that. I'm going to pay you one night. Okay, but you're not. I'm going to say, oh, I'm going to have it. Okay, 
they will prosper. And we act with love for them, and especially our love for our Lord, our new Lord, as it comes to our family. Heavenly Father, we give you thanks for the blessing of this day. Amen. Amen. You know, all along, all through the early hours of the night, we've been referring to each other as in-laws. But now, after receiving the blessing from both sides of the family, congratulations to Jennifer and Matthew. As I stand here watching both of you, and as the rest of this room, as everybody is witnessing both of you, we are looking at two beautiful couples that have been put together. You've both got ingenuity. It is now onward forever. And the last but not the least, you are now national. You are very educated. And when I look at two beautiful people, I see more beautiful children coming into this world. Ladies and gentlemen, the Igbo community in Dallas Fort Worth has blessed this family. And in most, most times in Igbo tradition, when we have a traditional wedding, about seven months later, later a baby pops out. <laughs> not, not nine years, or not nine months. But whatever it is, whether nine months, seven months, one year, whatever it is, the fathers have blessed this union with children and with progress. Prosperity forever and ever. Amen. Amen. I think at this juncture, they can officially. Just take a good fish from the Sorry. Sorry. This is the section where they get to be officially over there, right? Okay. After the photograph, they can officially assume. The seat of the king and the queen. Flying up, no ceiling when we in our zone. I got that sunshine in my pocket. Got that good soul in my feet. I feel that hot blood in my body when it drops. Ooh, I can't take my eyes off of it. Moving so phenomenally. You more like the way we rock it. So don't stop.